Once upon a time, in a great land, not so unlike our own, lived a powerful prince. For decades, his kingdom thrived, but now it was different. Day after day, he watched helplessly as his subjects became ill and died. Overcome with dizziness and pain, they fainted to the ground. Bleeding profusely from their pores, they died in solitude and silence. In his wisdom, to protect what was left of his dominion, the prince invited all his noblemen and their families to take shelter at the palace. There, he had stockpiled the best provisions money could buy, steaks, lobster, caviar, the finest champagnes. Inside, they would be safe and protected as they waited for this scourge to pass. After a while, as often happens, the nobles grew glum and listless. Seeing this, the wise prince prepared to give a party to cheer up everyone. It would be a masked ball. No expenses would be spared, and it would be the party of the century. As the festivities peaked, everyone forgot their troubles and the world outside. They danced and sang, and behind their masks, indulged themselves in everything they desired. They were having such a great time that no one noticed the presence of a dark stranger whose costume parodied the corpses outside. Seeing this disguise, the prince laughed and applauded. But when asked to remove his mask, the intruder simply walked away. Insulted, the prince pulled his dagger and pursued him. Through the many rooms, he chased the dark outsider. Finally, in the last room, the prince cornered him. As the figure slowly turned, the knife fell to the floor. Blood began to drip like sweat from the prince's brow. Then he collapsed at the stranger's feet. One by one, they all died peasants and nobles alike. No one was safe.